What is up you guys? We are back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get an exclusive reward here in Fortnite that's only going to be available for a limited time. Now if we go over here to our quest and I actually just learned about this today. Now if you go over here to the quest you can see that there's a story tab right here and if you click over you can see all of the quests right here. They do grant a pretty good bit of XP for doing them. I think I've mistakenly done part one or maybe I was trying to do it at some point and then kind of lost track and haven't done any more of the story line here in Fortnite. But don't worry though, I'm not going to make you guys sit here and watch me go through all of these because it is going to take a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and skip all of that and get to the very last quest we have to do, which will be down here. That should grant us that exclusive reward that you can only get by doing these quests right here. So we're now on part four of the storyline quest. It says talk to Peabody and P-Boy's headquarters. So we're going to go ahead and do that real quick. All right, so the next challenge here is going to be to help propagate Peabody's Peabody's in different matches. So if you look around in this area right here, you can see this little pod thing. So we're going to go ahead and search it. So we fed that one. Okay, so we're going to have to go into another match, I think, to do this. You got to do it across three different matches. So I'll be right back. So we're in our second match right now. So now we're just going to simply go in here just like this. Go ahead and feed Peabody's just like that. And we got to do it in one other match. So we're going to go ahead and return one more time. All right, so we're actually in our third match now. This should be the last time we have to feed the Peabody's. So we've taken care of that just like that. And now we have to, it says bounce on bouncy tires near Peabody's headquarters. So we got to do that. All right, now it says talk to Peabody's auto technician and training dummy. Okay, so we actually have to go across the map. All right, so here we are. We're talking to dummy and now we're going to go ahead and get through all of this. We're going to see what the next quest is. Okay, so damage vehicles to collect car parts. So we're going to damage some vehicles. Okay, so yeah, we're going to have to damage quite a few vehicles. Okay, let's go ahead and park it right here and let it heal. That'll make 19, and we only need one more. Look there, we got it. So that challenge is now done. All right, now we got to go ahead and take those car parts here to Peabody in order to receive the Pandora Gem. For some reason, I thought Dummy was Peabody, but he's clearly not. So let's, uh, let's go on back to where we came from. All right, we're going to go ahead and trade the car parts right here, just like that. And we got the gym. All right, we just need to deliver the Pandora gym to Hope now that we've traded the car parts. Go ahead and deliver the gym. And I think we're good. That may be everything we have to do for the part four story quest line. Now, I think the only thing we need to do is go back. Let's see. I don't know if we'll have the exclusive reward just yet. No. Okay, so we will get the exclusive reward after part five right here. So let's go ahead and track this quest. Now, after we do part five right here, this will go ahead and grant us the exclusive reward. So let's go ahead and jump back in the game and coordinate the plan with Peabody so we can get that done. All right, so now we just got to coordinate the plan with Peabody here. So let's go ahead and do this, pick up a couple of weapons, go over to him. What? They're taking on Megalodon. Yeesh, your funeral, pal, Earl. All right. Now, one of the locations where you will need to destroy objects will be right here. This is a wasteland location. I'm going to go ahead and pull up the map so you guys can see where I'm at, which will be right here. You can use this as an example to kind of, I think each of these locations will be considered wasteland locations. I'm pretty sure. All right, now we just got to eliminate wasteland guards or blow up vehicles. So we're going to make our way over here. We're going to also blow up vehicles. So what if we just blow this vehicle up? Shoot it a good bit. Pickaxe it. Yeah, that does actually way more damage. Okay, so we've done the one. So yeah, I was right. All right, so we're going to continue on up here. There is a good bit of guards, so that will make this pretty easy. Definitely should be 10. Yep. One... Another guard right here. Like three because we did the vehicle as well. Oh, so now they want me to pick up a vehicle and use it with the weapons after I've destroyed so many of them. So we got to find a vehicle. Oh, here's one. Oh, okay, we don't need to shoot it. All right, this here will make 500. Yep, just like that. Let's go. Now, it says we just have to damage him in order to get the map. So I don't know what that means. I mean, that clearly doesn't mean eliminate him. I don't guess. So let's just kind of do this. 
I'm not even sure. Oh, I think when we did damage him, he dropped the map. That's what it is. So you don't necessarily have to eliminate him. Okay, so we found the map. Now it just says to travel to Megalodon's hidden stash to find the Pandora gem. All right, so we pretty much arrived to the secret stash. We'll kind of look around right here. Could be at the top of that hill. What do you guys think? Oh, wait a minute. No, here it is. All right, we found it. Break open the box. Okay, so we got to break it. Okay, we got this. Take the Pandora gem. Probably have to bring this back to Hope. Deliver the final Pandora gem to Hope. Yep, that's what I figured. She's actually just right over here. I don't even know if I need a vehicle. All right, so we made it here to Hope. We just need to go ahead and deliver the gem just like this. All right, and we have delivered it. That's everything. So now we should be able to go back into the lobby and have our loading screen, our reward for doing all the challenges. Wait, there it is right there. Deliver the final Pandora gem to Hope. New loading screen. Cool, cool. So we did get it. All right, now here is the loading screen for doing all of the storyline quests. Loading screen, assemble the gems. Find them before it's too late. Okay, so we've done it. We have the exclusive loading screen, and that is exactly how you guys can earn it as well. Be sure to go ahead and do this before the season is over because it may never return. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Be sure to use my supporter creator code, Cody-72. Let me know down in the comments if this was helpful and if you guys are currently doing these quests or if you've already finished them. With all that being said, I'm going to wrap this one up right here, and I'll see you guys in the next one.